Hey there folks, this is Damon on David's Brain. Welcome back to our ongoing Let's Play of Persona 5 Strikers for the PS4. Please be sure to like, share, subscribe, comment, ring the bell, and contribute to my Patreon link in the description at the bottom. Alright, last time, uh, we managed to go, uh, yeah, the Fan Thieves tracked down uh, Natsumi's uh, trauma cell, as Futaba so eloquently calls it. And, yeah, now that it's, and now that it's been destroyed, uh, all it's left to do is to send out the calling card, and then uh, off the top of the Lord, uh, uh, Lord Prince... Uh, whatever the brat of uh, whatever the narcissistic brat that's sitting on a big ass throne and get, have forced him to have a change of heart and free the desires of all of his victims. I feel like chatting before we hit the sack. I hadn't guessed that Natsumi was being used by his editors. Yeah, but that's no reason to take people's desires and brainwash them. Hmm. I wonder how Alice and Natsumi attained their power. I have no clue, but I do know that right now we need to stop him. You're right. If we don't do something soon, the number of victims will keep increasing. No. By the way, do you think it was okay to leave the posting of the Kali cards to Senkichi? It shouldn't be an issue. I'm sure he doesn't want to lose his end of the deal. <laughs> this uh, be pretty lame. The only ones handling all this. Uh, be pretty, be pretty lame. We're the ones handling all this. The least we could do is let him send a message. I see. So that's what you call a deal. Seems I've learned something new yet again. Yes. Either way, once we finish get and once we're and once we finish getting ready, we'll probably want to go right to sleep. We take action tomorrow. Will do. All right, let's see here. Yep, bringing Yusuke along, bringing On along, and bringing Sophia. All right, all of, all right. Time to send the card and uh, time to go and uh, time to go and put Ned to not to be plagiarizing. Understood. I will entrust Sinkichi with this calling card, regardless of what drove Natsumi down this path. He has been gripped by vanity, turned to evil. If he cannot be, uh, see the distortion in his heart, then we will lay it bare. Alright. Showtime. And yeah, I'm hoping he just goes and plasters all the calling cards on his... Yep. <laughs> Mr. Natsume. Just as I thought. Good morning. I see there's quite a crowd today as well. Uh, yes, about that. What is it? Uh, did you notice all the calling cards there, dumbass? What? What is this? Well, when the staff came to open the store this morning, it was already like this. They called the police, but they were told to leave it as is, to preserve the crime scene. To the ostentatious swindler, Mr. Ango Natsume, you are a depraved miscreant who holds others in contempt and steals their work. Finding your own pockets all the while. We refuse to overlook the crimes you commit as you wear a false crown. Tonight, we take back the desires you've stolen. <laughs> Honestly, how stupid can you get? Damn it, what nonsense! I am the monarch. My followers are loyal. That is... As long as I hold their desires, no. Having these desires is proof of my claim to power. Proof of my sovereignty! I won't hand them over. I won't give them up! You foolish heroes are nothing but talk. Come then, I'll crush every last one of you! I'll never give them up! Not to anyone! Oh! <laughs> yeah, I know. Cognition should be changed now. Thank you for all your help, Mr. Detective. And with that, I've officially become an accomplice of the Phantom Thieves. Congratulations! What are you about? You're the one who proposed working with us, remember? As a reward, I'll try to start calling you Zenkichi instead of Gramps from now on. Okay? Yay! Inspector Hasegawa is quite a mouthful. Yeah, Zenkichi's good, don't you think? Okay, then. From now on, you're Zenkichi san, all right? I'm looking forward to working together, Zenkichi. Oh, fine, whatever. You've already dragged me along this far, then. Now then, the desires should have materialized at this point. It's up to us to take them back and return them to their rightful owners. And in doing so, we'll set his distorted heart straight. Oh. All right, time to go and bring this asshole back to reality here. More bond points.
All right, so are you just like heading straight on up to the keep or? All right, hold on a second here. Let's Time see. to go and cash these bonds. Oh, so we're not, and we're not getting the lyrical version of Life Will Change? All right, fine. Let's see here. Uh, increase the effects of healing items or hmm. Hmm, let's see here. Alright, yeah, meta versus meta here. Let's see here. Martial arts. And yeah, no. If I want the uh, if I want the trophy, I'm gonna need to max out all of these. So, yeah. All right, just going straight up into the castle then. Got it. Let's go. We're taking back those stolen desires. Yeah, Natsume won't know what hit him. All right, time for uh. Our destination. Going, then? All right, yeah. If you thought, the, uh, yeah, if you thought those editors of his were bad critics, <laughs> oh, <this may> be <laughs> boy, yeah, no, this is. Oh, perfect. I uh, wish could have been. Uh, we wish we could have been here to see it. It's definitely good to see that. Uh, not that disgusting statue off his ass. All right, I'm up and away then. I'm up and away, Superman. Great. It's like the desires materialized. Go get him, guys. And yep, once again, it's a big honking jewel. Excellent. I don't sense any shadows here. All right, the cage of vanity. All right, yeah. Where's the real Overlord? You are not my bow daddy, so get your host club ass down here so I can toss you off your throne. Hm. You certainly took your time, Phantom Thieves. Or should I say, chosen heroes? About time we met, eh, Mr. Overlord? We're gonna give back all those desires you stole. <laughs> All right, let's settle this. Bo uh, let's settle this, boyo. <laughs> Such foolishness! I have the slightest idea of what you've just walked into. That appearance, that stance. This is no doubt the Overlord from Prince of Nightmares. He certainly gives off that impression. But weren't the fearsome four just dressed like normal people? Yeah, thinking about it. Those guys didn't get much love from the author, did they? I wonder why. You come all this way only to fall right into my trap. This world belongs to me and me alone. It takes shape solely according to my design. Here, the Overlord rains justice upon the holier than thou heroes who would dare brand him as evil. Here, you are nothing more than flies to be swatted. I'll enjoy hearing those filthy screams as you atone for your transgressions. That's bold for someone who stole others' desires just to satisfy their own selfish wants. Yeah, if you're really the Overlord, ain't this the part where you get your ass kicked? <laughs> Tell me, how many of my demon brethren have you slaughtered while spouting such despicable hypocrisies? Wow, this guy's reading right from the handbook, isn't it? It's practically hovering in front of his face. It's time we fought. No matter how brave a facade you put on, it's clear you're just afraid of losing that hollow throne you're so proud of. What was that? Your reign is not but an illusion. Allow us to show you the truth. I'm sick and tired of everyone looking down on me. Yes, the time has come for my true power. You shall my final form! Oh, of course he's got a final form. Why wouldn't he? Uh, 
Oh god! <laughs> it's a JoJo Post Dragon! Let's see here. Yep, he's weak to ice and white. Well, with pleasure. Let the nightmare drag it, eh? Yeah, no, if he's anything like Alice, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm betting his final form has also got a second form, so. This one. Use this. This one. Guns. Ah. 
Persona, prepare yourself! What a I must say, that couldn't have gone better. Four! Go! Take this! Oh boy. Well, at least on uh, at least on like uh, well, unlike Alice, not to be really isn't putting up much of a fight. This one. And yeah, or with all this with this weakness surrounding him, yeah, all those fallen heroes he's talking about, yeah, it's all the artists whose pl uh, whose talent, uh, it's all the light novel artists whose whose uh, whose work he stole. Yep, constantly surrounded by his own guilt. I'm not. I got that. Way to follow up, Fox. 
You're down to his undies. Oh god, he, he wears boxers. Oh, that's just adorable. Let's see, forgetting of recalling skills. A persona can remember up to eight skills. If it learns another skill and has no uh, room to learn more, they'll need to forget a skill. A forgotten skill can be remembered by accessing a persona from the command menu. However, skills learned through fusion or through other methods of straightening will disappear if forgotten. Oh yeah, so you can just swap out moves whenever you want them? That's cool. Let's see here. Or at least we re relearn later. Not really sure why you'd want to, but whatever. Game over, Mr. Overlord. <laughs> Accept your defeat with some uh, modicum of grace. Oh, shut up. Oh, for... Oh, for crap's sake. My mantle! My magic armor! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Is that his true form? 
looks like it. So in the end, even his identity was just a cheap imitation. All show, no substance. It's over, Uncle Natsume. You're just a bunch of stupid kids! You don't know how much I'd suffer! It's not too late for me! I've still got my reputation as a writer! I've won an award! I've sold books! It's not too late! It's never too late! And that's good enough for you? <laughs> this fame you've acquired through deception and the brainwashing of others. Is that truly what you wanted? What was the real reason you started writing novels? I... I mean, I... Damn it! Damn it! I tried. I really tried. Just like everyone else, I read and read all through the night. For hours on end, like my life depended on it. And for what? Nothing I wrote was ever mine. It was just another work from Sogo Natsume's grandson. One, one ever acknowledged by effort. By effort? Not my work. Not even me. No matter where I look, all I see is a bunch of thoughtless idiots. Slaves to appearances and nothing more. Acknowledge me, damn it. Acknowledge Ango Natsume's efforts for once. I just want someone to see that I really tried. I do. Huh? It's very clear just how much work you've put into writing your novels. A life led by creativity is almost always a lonely one. No matter your profession. You were battling that loneliness. You braced yourself. Pouring your very soul into your writing. Bringing it to your publisher time and time again. I will gladly acknowledge such effort and determination. <laughs> There are many out there who would give up that battle. Even those of exceptional skill and creativity. To be able to continuously bring life to new works without giving up, however. That is perhaps the most exceptional talent of all. There was once a time when you kept fighting. That is one part of your career that could never be labeled a fabrication. So start over, Ango Natsume. Claw your way back up from nothing and move forward. After all, there are some things that simply cannot be painted without a blank canvas. <laughs> it is because everyone believed in me that I was able to choose the path I walk today. I stopped lying to myself and was able to begin anew. So it is now my turn to pay it forward. Even if I'm the only one in the world to do so, I will believe in you. <sighs> Stupid kid. Talking my damn ear off, but you're right. This identity of mine was built on nothing but lies. I don't need it anymore. I'll do it. I'll climb my way back up. And I'll do it on my own strength. I'll write a novel that'll capture the hearts of countless readers. Just like my grandfather before me, I'll write something I can be proud of. To everyone, I swear it! Good. And I'll be looking forward to the day I get to read it. <laughs> you know, I really am stupid. How did I let myself forget? I know now what it is I really wanted. Oh, and also, make sure you go and actually find an editor who isn't a piece of shit. That might help. The cage is collapsing. Come on, we're leaving. It's over for now. Cage of Vanity Conquered. Mission complete. I wonder if everyone's desires have been returned yet. Probably. They all went flying out of the cage after all. Uh, I'm st yeah, no, still worried. I mean, yeah, if all the desires didn't make it out of Alice's jail, then yeah. Maybe we should check on the people back in town, just to be safe. Good idea. That's it. 
Jail didn't disappear this time either. Now I'm sure of it. Jails really aren't the same as palaces. Well, we can worry about it later. Indeed. Let's go. Hey. Mm. Feel as though I'm restless right now. Do you know what this is? Some bothered you? I'm not sure what's wrong. Natsumi tried his hardest, but somewhere along the way, he lost sight of what mattered to him. He is a strange person, Natsume. Uh, uh, let's see. Well, unfortunately, the guy was a bit of a crook, and yeah, if he if he, if he honestly took what those pieces of shit said to his heart, uh, set to heart, uh, yeah. Do you really think so? Yusuke said Natsume lost his way because he was alone. Whenever I think about that, I feel restless inside. Even though Natsume hurt a lot of people and was, for some time, one of our enemies. What is this feeling? Yeah, it's empathy. The same Yusuke had. The same as Yusuke? I see. So that's why Yusuke saved Natsume. It was because Natsume's reason for doing all those terrible things was really sad. I think I understand now. Sadness can hurt people, but it can also save them. It can give humans a reason to support one another. You couldn't have said better myself. You can count on me. <laughs> okay, we should probably get going. So, you know how I was all excited for the Tanabata Festival that's coming up? My boyfriend says he's already got plans. Oh, by the way, did you ever finish reading that manga I lent you? I got someone else who wants to borrow it. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think it worked. Yeah. Doesn't look like anyone's talking about Natsume anymore. Then, all's as it should be. Attaining fame through some deceptive power doesn't fit his image. This wouldn't have been possible without you being there to open his eyes, Yusuke. You really took charge today, Inari. <laughs> He was a real hero there. Yep. Chosen hero Inari has restored peace and harmony throughout the land. Thank you, everyone. All right, more fun points. Ooh, Avenger. Evading an enemy attack no, grants counterattack. Must confirm whether the change of heart was a success. For now, we'll just have to wait and see how things turn out. Ugh. Well, since we've got some free time, can we unwind at a bathhouse or something? Oh, I'd totally be. Hey, man, sister. Idea. We can freshen up a little before we head back to the car. You heard him, Sophia. It's all you. Okay, I'll find the best bathhouse in the area. All right, let's see if the change of heart. Uh, yep, the press conference venue. Yep, the change of heart worked. Thank you, everyone, for coming. I've called this press conference to give an announcement, as well as a formal apology. First, my novel, Prince of Nightmares, was recently bestowed the honor of receiving first place in the Sokaisha Awards. I have decided to give the award back. I've also decided to recall all published copies, not to mention take the necessary steps to refund everyone's money. I'm sure you all want to know my reasons for doing so. The truth is, my book, Prince of Nightmares, only won because of my status as Sogo Natsume's grandson. In short, the competition was fixed. In addition, I've also stolen the work of countless other authors, word for word. Lastly, the story I told about writing to inspire a hospitalized girl was nothing but a lie to garner sympathy. This fabrication allowed my book to sell a number of copies it nowhere near deserved. I wish to apologize for this scandal, and I'll start by personally seeing to it that everyone who bought my book is refunded. I promise my writing career ends here. 
I am deeply sorry for all that I've done to all of you. Uh, hold on, Mr. Natsume. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Hey, time to wrap it up. Get everyone out of here, now. Please, don't interfere. This is my way of taking responsibility. Hey, something doesn't seem right here. Mr. Natsume is the one who put this thing together, right? Do you think the editors were just trying to profit off Mr. Natsume's family name? Bingo! Hey! Uh, uh, who, who are you? I will not allow this. You... You're the one from the party. I'm so sorry for what I said back then. I will not allow you to cower and run away, Ango Natsume. You intend to make a comeback, do you not? Huh? When you do return to the literary world, I want to see a book with your name on it, not your grandfather's. <gasps> you are going to write a novel that you can be proud of, are you not? Uh, give, oh, we'll be waiting for it. Better be, uh, better be a knockout. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Who are they supposed to be? Once everything is rightfully resolved, I will make my return. Even if there's just one person out there waiting to read my stories. No matter what, I will keep writing. I only hope I can one day save someone's soul. The way my grandfather's novel saved mine when I was young. That is why I write. And again, actually get an editor who isn't a, a living turd. Jeez, you kids are something else. Barging in on a press conference like that? My apologies. It was imperative that I speak with you. Eh, it's fine. Alright, well, I gotta run. I have to go question Natsume. Oh, right. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't end with just an apology. Senkichi's really doing his job. It's almost like he's an actual cop or something. I am an actual cop. Anyway, it won't take long. So go on and wait for me back at the car. Guess we should get rolling then. Right. We'll leave the rest to him. Do you have a moment? What's up? Something about Natsume's been bothering me. What he did was no doubt unforgivable. Nothing will change that. However, was he really like Madarame? Can he truly be called evil like the palace rulers we confronted in the past? Had he simply ignored his editors, would he have strayed from his path? Or am I perhaps just sympathizing with someone who pursues the arts like myself? What do you think? Huh. Well, yeah, no. On the one hand, he stole the talent and a potential futures of uh, an aspiring light novelist. But yeah, no. Madarame was at it for years and years before you discovered his palace. So yeah, Madarame... Uh, yeah, well, Natsumi may have been just as bad as Madarame. He had the potential to be a thousand times worse. But on the other hand... I mean, yeah, sure. Uh, yeah, sure. He uh, definitely didn't exactly have the right support uh, support system there. A bunch of people that were only just leeching off of his family name for cash. So, I see. Yes, it is a rather difficult question. Forgive me, I didn't mean to hold you up. We should return to the car as well. Let's go. Looks like everyone's heading back to the camper. We should go too. Thanks again. That all? Thanks for fun. Come again. All right. Well, while we're here, might as well go and grab. A, uh. And yeah, no. Unlike with Atlas, there's actually still people around here that hey, still support Natsubi. Yeah, maybe in time he'll be able to create his own work that he can be proud of, but without having to go rip off uh, other no uh, other light novelists, manga, and anime. Yeah, he could.
Oh uh, yeah, no, the reason- Oh uh, yeah, no. Uh, uh, big difference between uh, Madarame and Natsumi, he still has time to change his ways. Whereas Madarame, yeah, no, the guy was uh, the guy was a piece of crap from the start. What is it that you see? I shall await. Welcome, that all. Thanks a bundle. Thanks a lot. How can I help you? Will this be a tea? Here you go. Have you decided? Thank you. We've got what you need. So that's what you're getting? Can you hold up? We recommend. Can you hold? We recommend. Can you hold? So that's what you Thank you very So that's what you Thank you very much. So that's what you Can you hold all that? Stop by again. So. There's only more we could do now. We should wait until the hideout until Senkichi reaches out. Yeah, no, we are flush with cash right now. So yeah, getting some uh, souvenirs probably would, uh, probably some extra gear wouldn't hurt too badly. Although definitely might want to wait until I get all, uh, get to the next stop, where no doubt there's probably going to be even more goodies. Thank you for coming in. Is that what you do? You are. Is that? Thank you for the pop. Here you are. Come again. Yeah, who knows if uh, some of these steps are gonna, uh, some of these food steps are gonna be for a request or not. Hello, dear. Is that all you do? Is that all you think? Thank you. How may I help you? That's what you hear you want. That's what you can. <laughs> Alright, yep. On and Yusuke are well on the way to finishing their Master Arts. Heesh. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, no. Uh, these new Personas definitely were, uh, definitely, uh, definitely helped seal the deal. Although, yeah, granted, compared to when we first fought Alice, yeah, Natsumi's, oh, uh, Natsumi was nothing but bl uh, bluff and bluster, so. I should write something. And yeah, hey, at least with this new feature, we can actually go and refight the bosses, so, <laughs> there's that. Alright, so yeah, next up, we're gonna, uh, so when we come back next time, we're gonna be out on the open road. So, until next time, folks, this is David on David's Brain. See you when I see ya. Bye bye!